An Ellis County man is building dome homes, not only for North Texans, but for clients around the world. KDAF 33 Sandra Hernandez shows you why building round means going green. But I have my kitchen and little dining room over here. Terry Williams calls this round looking structure her castle. They're efficient and they keep very cool in this hot weather we've had. 74 environmentally friendly domes are currently rented out in Italy, Texas, about 45 miles south of Dallas. This is my home. David South lives in a six bedroom steel reinforced concrete dome. It's about 2,700 square feet and he's planning to build more. That's green in the fact we use some much less material. Two and a half inches of concrete are used to build these domes. A conventional building would require twice that. This is a section of the dome wall. As you can see, part of it is urethane. The other half is concrete, making it eco friendly. The concrete is a heat sink. It stores heat. It allows me to heat and cool this building with a one and a half ton air conditioner. South uses the smallest air conditioners in the market. You can see there's three of them out there and one there to cool this building. That's a fraction of what you would do in a standard commercial building. It saves the owner 50% on heating or cooling costs. There are double paned low energy film windows throughout and an energy recovery ventilator. It takes fresh air from outside, puts it into the house, brings the air from the house through and, and blows it into this area. Rainwater is also easily recycled. There's a 10,000 gallon water storage and I use that to capture the water for watering the plants and stuff around the place. Good morning, Monolithic. People from around the world attend workshops at the Monolithic Institute to learn how to build these structures. They include everything from the local high school gym to domes in 52 countries. South says he's trying to make a difference one dome at a time. In Italy, Sandra Hernandez, KDAF 33 News. And here's another bonus. The domes are also capable of withstanding tornadoes. If you'd like to know more about workshops at the Monolithic Institute, just check out our website at kdaf33.com.